Hi, you're watching MCS TV, where we dare to be extraordinary. I'm Abigail Munoz. And I'm Julian Chung, and today is our first show back from spring break, and it's a beautiful day outside. You can definitely feel the spring in the air. That's right, Julian. And springing into math and engineering, we'll meet math consultants to the school, Dr. Joe and Angie Sue, who are kind enough to give our students a few lessons in mathematics and engineering. Our very own Angelie Serrano caught up with Dr. Angie Sue with more. Angie? Thanks. Hi, I'm Angelie Strano, and I'm here with the Professor of Mathematics e Education, Ms. Angie Sue. So, Ms. Angie Sue, how are you today? Good, thank you. So, can you please give us um, a little brief summary of what like, lesson you gave us um, through the day? Well, um, what we're trying to um, share with you is the importance of uh, the mathematics and engineering field, how our math, science, and engineering work together hand in hand and that try to motivate uh, many of you to go into the field, especially women, girls. <laughs> and I, I believe that we were pretty successful trying to entice some of you uh, become future engineer, engineers and future scientists. And one of Dr. Angie Sue's lessons was geometry based and gave students a basis on 2D and 3D shapes. The visuals, according to Dr. Angie Sue, are supposed to aid students in learning. Uh, my philosophy of learning is you learn it in a logical manner and then you're able to make connections to the real world that you apply what you learn in the real setting so that you know the relationship between what's presented to you, and what you actually are learning. Dr. Josu, another highly skilled math consultant, created a mathematical model to help find shipwrecks that are almost nearly impossible to find on any other means. Our very own Charles Torres caught up with Dr. Sue and has more. Hi, my name is Charles Torres, and today I'm here with Dr. Josu, one of the co-founders of METS and a professor of ocean and mechanical engineering. Good morning, Dr. Joseph. How are you? Good morning, Charles. I'm fine. Um, Dr. Siko told us about a lot about the boat drift formula. Could you tell us exactly how you came up with it? Oh, it's just uh, we have a research project with uh, U.S. Coast Guard mm -hmm. at that time, and I have a doctor student work on it, doing numerical simulation, um, experiment, and field testing. And as a professor, I just think, sit down and, and think about it. And it's a very simple formula, so we come up with a very simple formula, which turned out worked very well, better than the numerical simulation. So we start to advocate that. Among Dr. Joe Su's other lessons included an introduction on how to make a glider out of a plain note card and one paper clip. So you have a, you have a piece of paper or, or a, a sensing, okay? And you want to glide it as far as possible, right? The most as successful as possible, gliders right? were constructed by Dane Henson, Vitan Abasevich, Christopher Archibald, our very own Omar Ben Hamid, our very own Charles Torres, our very own Oscar Hernandez, our very own Jabril Harris, our very own Peter Ibrahim, and our very own Angeli Serrano. Dr. Joe Su also helped guide students on an egg experiment, which consisted of making a parachute completely out of newspaper and successfully dropping off the second story balcony. Using engineering techniques, the best parachutes were constructed by Miasha Myrick, Taylor Evangelista, Tabitha Evangelista, Gianna Cepeda, Danleo Rivera, T. Evangelista, Brianna Thomas, Louis Campoverde, Devon Johnson, and Alexander Galdemus. On a lighter note, make sure to shine your dancing shoes because spring formal is quickly approaching. Tickets are still on sale for $35 in room 218 with Miss Fortis. Get them soon before time runs out. Just a reminder that today is a half day and lunch will be served. Thanks for watching Mess Charter School TV, where we dare to be extraordinary. I'm Julian Chung. And I'm Abigail Munoz, and we'll see you next week on MCS TV.